going on youtube family it is your girl right back to you guys with another youtube video as you guys can see the specs are a little bit different now you guys have been asking me on instagram for a while to get back on youtube why y'all want to know about me i don't know i ain't got a special life i don't know why y'all want to know so much but you ask for it i shall provide so i just got in the mail my camera the camera that i'm recording on right now and it's super distracting sorry to spit if you have a, a camera that has a viewfinder you tend to look at that opposed to looking at the lens so if you see me looking up i'm looking at the viewfinder if you see me looking in the lens i'm looking at y'all cameras in i'm excited um a lot of things have changed this year for myself and a lot of exciting things are on the way a lot of content that you guys want you guys want a lot of uh vegan videos you guys want grocery hauls you guys have been asking for like plant tours you guys have been asking for a lot of things so i want to provide all that i'm learning how to use this camera so please give me some time to figure this out i'm trying to figure out how this thing works um all of it um i'm about to i'm about to go head out to the gym very soon i missed my gym session this morning because i had to come get this camera because freaking amazon told me that it sh it was going to ship out today but nine times out of ten when they say they're going to ship out that day they really don't ship out that day and if it does it says it's going to get to you that the next day and sometimes it doesn't get to you the next day so i just wasn't expecting for today but anyway long story short got the camera had to charge the battery had to go get my sd card because there's one on the way that i bought with the camera but i'm like you know what i might as well just start vlogging today since i have the camera so i'm waiting on that one but anyway um i went to best buy got a new sd card and that is what we're filming on right now so uh this holding up my arm thing is probably not gonna work because my arm is already hurting I'm about to head out to the gym right now i need to charge my phone look at that my mom drew that my mom's a freaking dope artist dude my mom also drew this she didn't draw it for me my mom liked to play her hate on me for some reason but she drew, drew that as well i just had to wait for the battery to fully charge i actually just bought my plants in See my plant? I just brought my pothos in. Uh, I haven't watered it in a while, so my pothos, pothos, whatever, uh, has not been behaving. And it's crazy because, um, although I didn't water that when I watered it today and I put it outside, but my fern, I don't know if you guys can see the fern, but there you go. My fern was a little droopy this morning. I mean, cause I hadn't watered it in days and it, the leaves were actually falling down and I put water, I gave it water and I sat it outside for a few hours and look at it. It's like, it's alive again. My snake plant does not like humidity and I put it outside cause I didn't know how hot it was gonna be today and it looks sad. I'm sorry. But yeah, it's like um, 10,000 degrees outside. Actually, let me go ahead and check my phone. It is 95 degrees right now. And if you're in California, this is hot as hell today. We don't do this. This is disrespectful as heck. I'm a little traumatized right now, but anyway, we're gonna try to get ourselves to the gym right now. I'm gonna take my tripod with me so I can make sure I'm able to record. I've charged my phone, so we're good. This is just awesome to be able to have a camera now, y'all. This is cool. So, um, yeah, full body workout coming up now let me go ahead and answer these emails as well since this is a vlog you guys will catch me to answer these emails really quick so this is my life you guys want to know i get emails all day long i'm helping to run businesses i have my own business um i'm helping people run their businesses as well so answering emails all day is like my life um outside of, oh shoot all right i really gotta answer emails y'all so <laughs> You guys are about to literally get into my life. This is my life. Answering emails. All right. All right, guys. Emails have been answered for the day. Emails have just been answered for the moment. I'm gonna get more emails. Uh, I've been keeping up for the most part for the rest for, for today. But um, yeah, this is a day in my life. 
guys, a lot going on. When I get back today, I need to do some more work on my laptop uh, for my influencers. Ah, I just have work to do today. So let me go ahead and let's get out of here. Let's hit this gym, get out, get that out of my system so we can come back and get some work done. Um, it's hot in here, so I think I'm gonna keep the air on for my animals because it's hot as heck. And I know they're struggling. And this is my little baby. This is three. Say hi, Chi Chi. <laughs> that is my baby, Punk. Hi, Punk. So that's Mama. My bedroom is not really furnished. I'm not really one of those people who needs to have all that furniture and stuff in their bedroom for show. That's cool and all, but I plan on making a different, I don't know if I'm even gonna be here come next year. So I don't wanna buy all of this furniture and I may not even be here. I'm, I don't even know where I'm gonna be in the next year. And I mean that honestly, if I'm here, then great. If not, I'm not gonna waste my money on cabinets and stuff and not cabinets, but you guys know what I mean, dressers and stuff. Take the elevator down to the car garage. I have a gym inside of my complex, but I don't use it often because I just don't have enough stuff. I just don't have enough stuff for me anyway. <laughs> and we are here. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Let's head out to the gym. The gym is only like 12, 15 minutes away, so. We're gonna head out of here. Let's go. All right, guys, so I just made it to the gym. And on my way here, I realized I haven't eaten all day long. <laughs> I haven't eaten since 7 p.m. yesterday, and that is not okay. But um, again, this is just me being honest with you guys, just keeping it real. Like, this is a day in my life. Sometimes I forget to eat because I'm busy working on other projects, um, but there's no excuse for that. But if I'm gonna give you guys vlogs, you guys get to know what's really going on. So I'm um, coming from having a food addiction to now sometimes not eating enough. It's a lot. I've struggled throughout the years. I just think it's more so of me uh, having to focus. Um, sometimes I'm just not focused on what I need to get done opposed to focusing on other projects. So I am going to head into the gym. You guys can see the gym right there. You guys already know I'm at 24, of course. So I will see y'all inside the gym. All right, guys, so I just finished with the gym. Worked out for a little bit over an hour, an hour and 11 minutes. 
and uh, burn about 600 something calories according to the watch. You know, these things are not always 100% accurate or not at all accurate, um, but it gives you a roundabout. Head to Costco right now. I'm only at a half a battery left for the camera. Um, I did record a little bit inside the gym so you guys will see the footage there. I may not record until I get back home, so be patient y'all because I'm looking at the camera and we won't have a half a bar. All right guys, so I just got in from the gym and the Costco run. Oh gosh, so I come home and again, day in my life. I come home to that. Yes, that is, that, that's my plant on the floor because when you have cats, you know how that works. It's not even like just that plant that my cats like to knock over and this happens a lot. It's this one as well. It's this one right here, which is my palm. Of course, dirt. And then they always leave me like a little gift of cat balm. Just make me some food. I have a protein shake and then I'm also gonna have another high protein meal. Um, yeah, I just, today was just not the best day. So, yeah, here we go. And so, um, I've had this for a while, these Satan strips. I've had them for a minute. Um, first time using them, never tried them before. Well, clearly that's what that means when it's first time using them. It means you haven't tried them before. Like, no. Oh, we have our garlic, onions, as well as red bell pepper. I went ahead and cut up the seitan. And of course, I oiled the cast iron grill with a little bit of virgin olive oil. Not only did my cat freaking mess up and I need to clean it <laughs> I'm being lazy not only did my cat push down my plant I couldn't even find the words I'm sorry y'all but they broke the blind so now I have to call and get that repaired or fixed or have them bring another blind up because people can see it in my place now so this is oh lord I tell y'all like pets think twice I'm gonna go ahead and add my one and only balsamic vinaigrette dressing. This dressing only has literally like four to five ingredients. And for this dressing, I've noticed that it starts to separate rather quickly because there's not a lot of processed uh, ingredients inside of it. All right, so now that my salad is done, I have my avocado and everything. I'm gonna go ahead and just clean up really quick because I don't like to have stuff out um at all while i'm eating so i want to go ahead and clean up and then i'll eat after i just finished that meal it was so good we are doing some work <laughs> workout plans um answering emails just just a lot after i'm done with this i'm probably gonna spend like one more hour on this because it's nine o'clock it's almost yeah it's nine o'clock and i just want to read at least at least about 30 minutes today on this magazine that i just got about uh power protein 
It is 11.14 at night. Um, I should have been in bed at least an hour ago. I'm tired. Um, I have to get this content edited tonight for tomorrow's post. And one other project before bed. It's already, um, like I said, past 11. So, good morning, everybody. Happy Tuesday. It is the next following day. I actually did not wake up early today. I was not feeling good. Um, 8.42. Um, I started my lady yesterday. And I was actually pretty good yesterday. And really good energy yesterday, too. Usually, I might wipe out, but... I took some medication last night because I have to take medication when I'm on it because you guys don't even want to know how bad it is, but that's just a lot of TMI. So anyway, I took medication. It makes me go to sleep and it keeps me in bed. So um, I woke up actually about 15 minutes ago to a crap ton of emails <laughs> that I had to respond to and then get content out because my alarm did not go off. So um, I still have the email I need to respond to this morning. I'm about to feed my little girl, my cat, the, uh, uh, an actual cat. <laughs> I'm gonna feed her, and uh, cause she's begging for her food. And after which, uh, we'll just go ahead and get the rest of our day started. About to make my green juice it's what i do every morning um i have ginger cucumber apple kale and chard Alright guys, so I'm going to do my morning skincare routine. Sorry if it's loud, it's my restroom fan. Um, I guess let it get ready with me this morning. So, first thing is first, I'm going to brush my teeth. I have my water pick, if you know what this is. This is what I use for my teeth before I brush my teeth to get all the food out before I go in and brushing everything. It just makes me feel better. So what I do is I fill this up with water and I use this nozzle, I'll turn it on, use that nozzle and go in between my braces and in my teeth to get all the food out before I start brushing and moving things around. I brush my teeth with my spin brush. It may be dirty, y'all, my bad. <laughs> it's the Earl B spin brush. You guys know how spin brushes work. toothbrush the reason why I use this is because I like to get whatever's left over in my mouth that I may not have been able to reach with the spin brush and then also to clean my tongue and the roof of my mouth because I don't find this to be very um, I don't find this to be very useful for the roof of my mouth and my tongue so I like to make sure my tongue is completely cleaned off of course rinsing it off again it's like an OCD thing I'm gonna get my gums tongue and the roof of my mouth now I'm going in with my tongue scraper. Put this in the back of your tongue and pull. Pulling motion. And your tongue and pull. We're gonna go ahead and go in with our Crest Advanced Mouthwash. Wash. 
I forgot to tell you guys that I need to floss. This is my brand new one. The other one I think is somewhere. I don't know. It's called Super Floss. So this is actually the floss you use if you have braces. There you go. This is the floss you use if you have braces. Um, the way that it works is it actually comes with this pointed end here. It comes with a pointed end. And it literally is like a needle and like a needle and thread going in between your brackets. So you take the end, go in between your bracket. So you'll have one end inside of your bracket and the other one out. And you floss. And you do that for every single bracket so I'm actually going to start from the back because I don't start from the front. So I'm going to do this actually the real way right now. It's not a game. It's a red stick. Alright guys, so I just finished flossing. Alright, so now it's time for my skincare routine. I use these Trader Joe's wipes. About maybe one of these. And then I also use my tea tree oil. Uh, you can get this on Amazon or anywhere. And then I also use my Trader Joe's uh, facial toning rose oil, or rose water, excuse me. One of these wipes. Take a different one. <laughs> Take a different wipe. Clean your face really good. Make sure you guys get those uh, oily areas, those areas that you usually get like acne in. And so this is what it looks like. Even though I washed my face last night, that's what it's looking like this morning. After I'm done with that, I'm gonna rinse my water with, rinse my face, rinse my face with cold water. The reason why I use cold water is because it helps open up your pores. It helps pull everything out. So while my pores are open, I'm gonna go in with the rose water. And also go with the tea tree. Tea tree oil, raw oil. You only need a little bit. This stuff is really, really strong. So I'll only put it on the areas that I get acne on. So my problem areas. It's the only place I put this. And that's it. I do not dry my face. I said I let my face air dry. And that's all for my skincare routine. After I'm done with that, I'll sew my face with some um, raw coconut oil. And that's it. All right, so for the coconut oil that I use is um, regenerative organic coconut oil, virgin, unrefined, whole kernel coconut oil uh, I got this at Sprouts I love this coconut oil it reminds me of the other one I used to get it was called Vita Coco and I used to get that off of Amazon but Amazon I, I don't think they sell it anymore and I love coconut oil that actually smells like coconuts I love it so I use this for my everyday use I don't use it out of that container I actually have my own little container um, here of my coconut oil I, all I do is get a container here from a Dollar Tree 99 cent store, pour it inside so I have it easy accessible. This one right here stays inside the kitchen for either refills or if I want to use it for food. Um, and also I give it to my cats inside of their cat food sometimes because cats love coconut oil. They love sweet oils like that. Um, it's also really good for their skin to help moisturize their skin as well as really good for their fur to bring a nice... Uh, shiny coat to their fur so use that for them as well and um, yeah my face is almost dry almost 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 dry so while my face is dry I'm gonna go ahead and hydrate my scalp with this Shea Moisture um, leave-in conditioner leave-in treatment I use it every single morning Make sure my hair is moisturized. 
Make sure I get my ends, my nape, which gets really, really dry because of taking showers, sweating at the gym, wiping my neck. Oh, this gets really, really dry. And lastly, while my face is still drying, I'm gonna go ahead and use this Aunt Auntie Jackie's. Oh, Aunt Jackie's, excuse me. Aunt Jackie's buttercream for the rest of my hair. So I use it on the scalp and also the braids themselves just so my hair gets fully moisture or full moisture and my ends are not being neglected while they're in the braids to help keep my hair hydrated and moisturized while it is in the braids. If you are a person that really cares about your hair health, you should be doing this every single day. If if not every other day or when you feel your hair is dry. I like to put some type of moisture on my hair every single day because it's hot. It's hot right now and people forget that summertime means your hair needs more hydration because the sun is literally drying out your scalp. It's drying out your skin and your hair is very fragile so you should be moisturizing not only your skin, but your hair, because it lays on top of your head and it protects your scalp. So you have to make sure all of it is protected and all of it is moisturized at all times. All right, you guys, so that's it for Aunt Jackie's. My face is about dry. All right, so the edge control that I use is this edge control right here, the instant control. Um, edge and braid gel maximum hold take my little toothbrush that I have for my edges and I literally just go in I don't like to leave too many edges or too much edges out I only start to do my edges when my braids start to get older that's when I start laying my edges and as you guys can see I moisturize them first before I put anything else on them and that's how you take care of your edges. That's how you preserve your edges. Moisturize first before you lay your edges because some edge controls can be very drying for your, for your edges. And this edge control right here, um, it can be pretty drying for sure. So I like to just make sure my stuff is moisturized before I put it on because I love the hold. I just don't want my hair to be um, affected by it. And just for a little bit of smell good, I'm gonna go ahead and put on my Victoria's Secret Bottom Show. Just a little bit, cause I'm heading to the gym. I don't need a lot. And that is it, y'all. I already have my sports bra on for the gym. I'm gonna put my leggings on, put my shoes on, and I am out for the day. I'm done. So thank you guys all so much for joining in my Get Ready With Me and A Day In The Life Of Me. This uh, day in the life was also, it was very, very small. I didn't really have a lot going on uh, yesterday, but uh, after this, after the gym, my week is gonna be pretty hectic. So I'm happy I actually started to vlog yesterday. So you guys, I was able to vlog for you guys. So anyway, I am done. You guys have an amazing day and i'll see y'all next time make sure you guys like comment and subscribe and don't forget to press that bell notification so you'll be notified every single time i upload a video see y'all later y'all peace